welcome back to my channel. So today I did a little quick style with some flat twist on the side, just so I could change it up a bit. No color, very quick and easy. It took me three hours to complete this look. It took a bit longer because I did my makeup in between, but <laughs> this is the final look. So if you want to see how I achieve this look, keep on watching. <laughs> okay, so don't mind this. Yesterday I took down some an old twist style, the style that I have on my how to style your sniggly twist slash box braids. Well, I had that style in for a while. I think it was a month. I washed in between, refresh, but some in the middle I didn't redo. Those were a little bit tangled, just a little bit, just a little bit. It was a little bit of a struggle. Washing my hair yesterday, washing my hair yesterday, but yeah, I just woke up, so my voice is gonna crack. Um, so I washed my hair with the Aussie Miracle Smooth Shampoo and Conditioner. It has um, aloe and Australian sea kelp. It smells really good. Other than that, my hair was really tangled. Um, not because of these, mostly because I let my style in way too long. So yeah. And then I use the Jane Carter Solution Creamy Leave-In Styling Smoother Curl Enhancer. I thought it was just a leave-in conditioner, but I never seen it at my store, so I decided to buy it. So I used two pumps per twist. These are twists, by the way. I just bent to knotted them like very loosely because um, I felt like it. And then I spritzed some argan oil from OGX before I went to bed. And now it's the next morning and I'm ready to style my hair. <laughs> All right, so what I'm gonna use today is this pack of hair. It's from the Janet collection called Kinky Crush. 36 inches, expression three times, but it has three bundles. It's in the color four, obviously. Um, and can someone tell me why they do this? That's like a waste of hair, isn't it? Isn't it? Why do, why do they do this? Let me know. Let's get started. Okie doke. So as you can see, I didn't take that much extension per twist. I really wanted it to look as natural as I could and just to get a little bit of volume. I also moisturized the hair as I was going up my head. I used a twist defining cream and a little bit of that um, Jane Carter solution leave-in smoothing cream. Wait, let me get the name right. Right, so it's the Jane Carter solution creamy leave-in styling smoother. <laughs> Now to do these flat twists, I left about slightly half of the front of my hair for them. The first flat twist, I kind of created this L shaped because I wanted to be a little fancy with it. Didn't really know how I was gonna install the extensions for this flat twist, but I made it work, you guys. All I ended up doing was following this reasoning. I always start my flat twist with a regular twist and then feed in my hair from the bottom or the side or whichever direction the flat twists are going. So this time I added the extension hair at the beginning of the flat twist and added my own hair to complete it. I didn't add any more extension on the flat twist just because I think it would look too big and disproportionate to the rest of the style. Remember that when twisting your hair from the roots, if you want to twist your hair away from your face, you have to twist both strands towards your face. Otherwise, your twist won't hold and your style won't last as long. All right, so I'm gonna let this play out so you can see what I did to style the hair.
remember how they packaged that hair? I had to do something with these ends. So I used different sized flexi rods so that I could give the illusion of how your hair would naturally coil because it's never the same. And then dip the ends in hot water to set the curls and that's it. pretty easy I don't know if I was able to clearly explain how I did these flat twists but initially I thought it would be complicated to feed in the extensions for the flat twist but it ended up being really easy you just start off like regular twist extension and then you feed in the rest of your hair and it was really simple so it'll be a breeze for you <laughs> this is a cute little style gives me a bit of volume so, yep. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope to see you on the next one. Bye.